Hey everyone, happy Monday. Well, it is for me at least. Um, <clears throat> today is my 21st day, and it's the 21st day of December, so I've been doing one workout um, a day all December long. For some reason, I always do well in December, I don't know. Um, if you believe in the zodiac, it just has to do with my sign, I don't know. But um, I like December's. And it's a good month, you know? Like, it's cold outside. You're not out running around, playing in the sand and the beach. So it's perfect time to hit those workouts hard. Um, today's workout is chisel balance. My third time through this workout. So what I'm noticing is I'm heavying up the weights a little bit. And uh, really focusing on form, like the last set of row one leg squats, you know, like I went down in weight a little bit. I was at 25s, went to 20s, and uh, just focused on really good form for it. And that was fun. I enjoyed it. It's good for me. Was it good for you? Um, so I like the workout. Good stuff. I'm, I'm sweating, lit, you know, right? I literally just finished the workout, hit, hit pause to turn it off, and then got the camera. So my breath right now represents, you know, how hard it was. And it's a good workout, like 38 minutes. I'm, I'm going to say it's not one of the fastest paced workouts. Like, you feel the time as you're going through it. It's, um, you know, pretty, pretty, it's a little bit slower of the workouts. Let me say that. And one of the reasons is you do a move, uh, 15 reps, and then you do a move on the other leg, 15 reps. And then you go back and you repeat it all. Unless it's like an upper body um, move. Um, and then you just kind of do 15 reps and then repeat the 15 reps and you're done. But that workout is a little bit more monotonous that way. So I also wanted to comment on the, my new hammer and chisels, chisels gear. Okay, so Autumn unbeknownst to us, has been wearing different gear that she's actually designed so that Beachbody had the opportunity to um, sell it. So uh, just recently, they kind of released all the gear in the store. So it's all Autumn's gear, and there's some extra watches and stuff. And then there's some stuff that says Master's Hammer and Chisel. So I'm wearing a tank top. I actually... So this is what I have to say about the new gear. Is the sizing chart sucks. Okay, um, shoot, I don't even know how to say this. I'm, I wear like a 42 regular jacket. Typically, um, if I'm really beasting up, you know, maybe I can go to 44. Um, and typically I wear a large tank top and it's a little loose on me. This tank top here, well, first of all, I love the cut. Like it's wide open cuts, great for pull-ups, great for curls. You got perfect range of motion, so I really like that. Um, but this size... It's like skin tight on me, and this is a large. So if you're used to wearing an extra large, well, let's say large tank top, you might want to go up one size if you don't like it this tight. If you want it tight, you know, you're right, you're right on. In fact, I usually wear it large, it's a little loose. I'm wearing this large, and I really like the way it fits. But just not what I expect, I expect it to be loose. Okay, so now what else? What other gear is there? Um, I bought one of these, I don't know what they call it, a sport a stretchy fabric tank top too. This is, see, and because Beachbody is doing their own brands now, it doesn't tell you who the manufacturer is. And I for one don't really like that because you know, if it's a Hanes shirt, you know, I know how Hanes fits me. If it's something else, you know, a lot of times American apparel, I kind of know how those shirts fit. So this is another cool shirt, basically same logo, but it's that real stretchy material. So these ones I know typically are real tight. So I went ahead and ordered an extra large because I love this material, but I don't want it to be skin tight. I want it to be like loose where it flows on me. So extra large is still tight. I mean, this typically fits me like a large one. So on these shirts, if you don't want it tight, I'd say go up one size. This is an extra large, 
So I should have got a double X to fit the sizing that I wanted. Okay, next next gear here is the um, hammer and chisel shorts. Well, first of all, what I want to say about the hammer and chisel shorts, who picked these this color scheme? <laughs> like the blue and the yellow or green is it? Like I don't really get that, but whatever. You know, Siggy's wearing them in the workout, so I thought it'd be cool. One thing I want to say about all the new gear is they are um, branding it really well. I don't know if you can see that. This is beach body all around the band. So I went like on the first week, if not the first day that this gear was out and they didn't have large shorts uh, using the size guide. That's what I needed. So I got extra large thinking, oh, they'll be real, real loose and at least I can wear them to bed. I put these guys on and <laughs> especially with the shirts that are so tight, like it looked horrible. Um, and the shorts literally were loose enough to fall off. Now there is a drawstring on them, so that's okay. But what I'm gonna say about the shorts is, you know, to stay your typical size there, or maybe even go down a size, because those, um, the extra larges are huge. All right, well, I don't know anything else about the autumn gear, so I can't really comment on that, except I'm sure all the tops are very skimpy. Um, so whatever you have to say about that. So that's my two cents in the gear that I bought. Um, I like to get it because I like to wear it for logos. Like if you wear this out to the mall and somebody see the commercial, they're like, what, how did you do? Were you in the commercial? They don't know. It just starts conversations. Um, and if you're using it for promotions and gear, like so, like this video works perfectly. And if you're, if you're a coach, it's a tax write-off. It's a tax write-off. Don't tell, don't tell anybody I said that, but it totally is because you're promoting products. So um, yeah, I usually get this stuff right off the bat. Um, This is a cool shirt, you know, and there's kind of always different opinions on this. Like I am not a guy that likes to wear super tight clothes, even if I'm super fit, you know, like I'm not out there. It's just not comfortable for me. So my girlfriend likes this shirt on because she likes it a little bit tighter. This shirt, she said, still looks okay, but it's it's more of a Sagi fit, is what she said. And like, I would, I don't really don't think I would wear this out much at all. It's a little bit kind of wife beater ish. Um, but for working out, for doing pull ups, I love this t shirt. Tighter than I would have thought it. Tank top. Tight, a little tighter than I thought it would have been. But now I'm gonna go back to the online. I'm gonna do it before I post this video, and order like three more of them uh, now that I know that I like this. And it'll be great shirt for um, resistance days. And today I did cardio, but you know, there's a lot of um, back flies and stuff like that. So it felt good for that too. All right, everybody, wrapping up another day of hammer, I'm sorry, chisel balance, really good workout. I was breathing hard, I sweated. Good one to do with the girlfriend. You can use the bench, don't have to use the bench. We actually have two benches. And sometimes we, she chose to use, sometimes she didn't. I use the bench every time. I like the added intensity that it brings, but it's good stuff. All right, well, thanks again to everybody who watches the video. Again, if it helps one person, worth my time and love. I don't know how you do that love thing. That's like one-handed love. Love, love to everybody that posts. I really appreciate it. Keep the questions coming. Getting a lot of questions coming in now, especially on the like page. And I appreciate that because that tells me what I'm leaving out of the videos, how to improve, and then just lets me know that people are watching them. So thanks for that. If you have any questions, feel free to reach out. Easy cheesy. Talk to you later. Keep chiseling it out.